welcome to today's maths class. I am your maths teacher Deepika Dubey. Today we will do chapter Carts and Wheels Part One. In today's chapter, we will study about circle and its path. So let's begin. Targeted learning outcomes for today's class are to familiarize in identification of circles, to be able to draw circle rough-handed or by tracing. To understand the components of the circle, competency focused are knowledge and understanding. Look at the picture shown. Kids are playing in a garden. One child comes, rolling a tire by pushing it. The tire is rolling because it is round in shape. In previous classes, you have done. that all the circular objects or round objects rolls on a floor look at the picture shown these are picture of the round objects easily found in your houses chapati cooker rubber bangles bindi buttons coin all these are circular objects they have no corners and a curved surface look at the pictures children in both the pictures children are playing by making a circle i am sure you also play games by making a circle some games made by making a circle are fire in the mountain duck duck goose ringa ringa roses catch and don't catch etc but students have you ever thought why do we make only circles in these games why not square or a rectangular we make circle because it is easy to make a circle as it has no corners and no edge and we can play smoothly around a circle and run around it but if we make a square or a rectangular we cannot play properly we cannot run smoothly because of corners and edges look at the picture a and b which picture do you think is a perfect circle yes b is a perfect circle what is a circle a circle is a simple closed curve which has no corner or edge what is circumference of a circle children see this pink boundary the length of the boundary of a circle is called circumference of the circle what is radius of a circle a radius is a distance between center of a circle and any point on circle for example oc and od are radiuses of the circle all the radius are equal in length what is chord of a circle a chord is a line segment that joins two points on the circle for example mn and cd are chords of the circle what is diameter of a circle a chord which passes through the center of the circle is called diameter of the circle pq is diameter of the circle its radius are op and oq diameter is the longest chord of the circle now let's quickly revise what we have done in today's class circles are rolling objects and do not have corners circle has a center a circumference a radius a chord and a diameter now we come to assessment section of today's class children do these questions in your maths copies question 1 trace a circle and draw two chords on it and also name them you can trace a circle using a bangle a coin or any circular thing at your home question 2 how many radius can a circle have question 3 give one word 
read the statement and identify the term from this. A. Longest chord of a circle. B. It is a line drawn from center to the circle. C. It is boundary of a circle. D. It is half of diameter. Question 4. List 10 circular objects in your house. Hope you enjoyed today's class. Thank you.